Here we go with the last video in Unit 9, 9.6, titrations. Now we're just going to quickly review what the neutralization reaction is. Right? We have to understand that neutral is neither acidic nor basic. And a neutralization occurs when an Arrhenius acid and an Arrhenius base react to form water and a salt. Okay, so down here, we can see here's our acid HCl. Here's our base, NaOH, hydrochloric acid, sodium hydroxide, and they react and form water and salt, and this is neutral. Uh, also, if you take a, an antacid for an upset stomach, neutralizes the acid in the stomach, it makes a neutral salt to provide relief. So an antacid is actually a base. Okay, remember, it's acid plus base makes salt and water. Okay, so here, an acid-base titration. We're going to do this in class where you have... This is called a burette, and you'll have acid or base. You guys are going to actually have two burettes, one with an acid, one with a base in it, and where you're going to deliver a certain amount of acid and then you're going to deliver a certain amount of base, and you're going to measure the volume of each. Now, when you read a burette, the amount of liquid delivered is the final burette reading minus the initial reading. So titrations are used to calculate the concentration in molarity. Remember, that's moles of solute per liters solution of an unknown solution. So an acid of an unknown molarity is reacted with a carefully measured amount of a base of a known molarity to the point of neutralization, or vice versa, where a base of unknown molarity is reacted with a carefully measured amount of an acid of a known molarity to the point of neutralization. In all neutralization reactions, there must be a one-to-one -one ratio between the moles of hydrogen ions and the moles of hydroxide ions. And then we do a calculation. So the titration calculation from your reference table, MAVA equals MBVB, where MA is the molarity of your acid, or the H+. The VA is the volume of that acid. The MB is the molarity of your base, the molarity of the uh, hydroxide ions, times the volume of the base. So anytime we're dealing with titration and neutralization work problem, we're going to use this titration formula. Make sure all units are in agreement. If we're using milliliters for volume here, we better use milliliters for volume here. Then they'll cancel out, and you'll get the right answer. So here's an example. What is the concentration of a solution of hydroiodic acid if 0 0.3 liters is neutralized by 0 0.6 liters of 0 0.2 molar solution of KOH? So we have to use our titration formula. MAVA equals MBVB. And like always, MA equals VA equals MB equals VB equals. What is the concentration of solution of HI? So the concentration is molarity, so that's what we're solving for. If 0 0.3 liters, so that's our volume, 0 0.3 liters, is neutralized by 0 0.6 liters, so that's our VB, 0 0.6 liters, of a 0.2 molar, that's our concentration, 0 0.2 molar solution KOH. So we're solving for MA. So MA equals MB VB, if I divide both sides by VA, I get over VA. Now I plug and chug. 0 0.2 molar times 0 0.6 liters divided by VA, 0 0.3 liters. Liters cancel, and I have 0 0.2 times 0 0.6 divided by 0 0.3, which is going to equal plug that into our handy dandy calculator 0 0.2 times 0 0.6 divided by 0 0.3 and it equals 0 0.4 0 0.4 and my units are molar
molar. So the molarity of this acid is 0 0.4 molar. All right, I'll do a, another example. Pay close attention to this so we don't have to spend so much time in class going over these. What is the concentration of a hydro, hydrochloric acid solution if the 50 milliliters? All right, so let's write this out. MAVA -A equals MBVB. MA equals VA equals MB equals VB equals. If 50.0 milliliters of potassium hydroxide, okay, so that's my base, 50.0 liters, or milliliters, of 0 0.250 molar, so 0 0.250 molar, needed to neutralize 20 milliliters, so 20.0 ml, and we're looking for the molarity of the acid. So MA equals MBVB over VA. MB, 0 0.250 molar. VB, 50, 50.0 ml, divided by VA, 20.0 ml. ml's cancel. I'm left with molar, which is what I'm looking for. I plug into my handy dandy calculator, 0 0.250 times 50.0 divided by 20.0. And I get 0 0.625 molar. Question time particular acid has an H plus concentration of 0.1 molar and a volume of 100 milliliters. What volume of a base with 0.5 molar hydroxide will be required to neutralize this reaction? So the lucky winner of this quiz is going to have to come up and do the MAVA equals MBVB calculation. So I strongly recommend writing this out ahead of time, plugging everything in ahead of time so you can do it quickly. All right, that brings us to the end of our unit on acid bases. I will see you guys in school.